the one you really need no matter where you are yeah don't wanna be the guy you only call can as soon as i go home as this is where my jokes and i die down they go down i always fall in love in their papas but i don't really know if i should trust you i see more your body when i made it up i wonder i i still wanna be your man but did you know that we can be treated like a baby i still wanna be your man i don't wanna be dead but i won't get this in my feelings my feelings yeah i need no more your word don't go no no Hey guys, what's up? What's good? Welcome to my channel. My name is Sheikha Kulet. But since you're watching this, you can call me Makoti with the vibes. But now the name has changed for this series. It's Mama Vibes. Mama Vibes. Um, we're continuing our pregnancy journey. I am still seven months pregnant. I feel like I've spoken to you guys while I was seven months pregnant, right? Yeah, so still on the seventh month and today I actually have my photo shoot of which guys a lot has been happening We say a lot has been happening But before I get into that, let me show you guys my face. My face is so cute. My baby edges are so cute My hair is so cute as in only my fit is not cute, but I got cute fits in the boot my carriage did my face as per usual and my Sakura dread guys, the one who did my hair. <laughs> um, yo, Sam. I sent Sam to buy his food. Now he keeps calling. Hello. Yes, fam. Hello, guys, go to my day. My day is just a lot. My day is a lot. So, and my day started so early. My makeup um, appointment was at. No, guys, if I keep looking this side, I'm actually looking out for Sam. Um, my makeup appointment was at 9 a.m so i've been out of the house since then now it's like 2 p.m and since i had breakfast at home i did pack my shake of which i still do drink my shake when i'm pregnant but i haven't even had the chance to drink it i was actually so frustrated in the morning guys you have no idea you have no idea so i had ordered clothes for my maternity shoot like three different outfits Two for the studio shoot and then one for an outdoor reel but they have not arrived and it's been three weeks and like I was just hoping this whole week I was like please Lord let today be the day haven't received them had to look for a plan B last minute and the plan B I didn't really like the plan B um, because the other dress was like one of my old dresses that's just plain black and then why is Sam coming back without food why are you coming back without food because they said 15 minutes. Ah, uh, bro. Okay, chicken, normal chicken. Hmm? Normal chicken. Normal chicken. Eh, the normal one. This is what did you buy? They like, said oh, all is going to take 15 minutes. Everything. Everything. That's what they said. Sure. So we have to wait 15 minutes. 15 minutes for food, imagine. What were you supposed to be drinking? Drinking? Yeah. Where? I didn't order it. Ah, I'm fine. Okay. I just want food, dog. I'm hungry. Okay, cool. Ah, Guys, Sam is eating our studio money. How? We don't have clothes. We don't have studio money. <laughs> okay, no, I'm joking. Maybe <laughs> if we are full, we'll get to think straight. <laughs> <laughs> So guys, I was still saying that. Oh wait, this is Sam. Sam say hi. Hi guys. Guys, this is my videographer, strategist, manager, everything. <laughs> you know, all the topics, all the titles. Yes, guys. This is part of my pregnancy journey. So I'm telling them that we are mm -hmm. doing a maternity shoot today and the drama with my dresses yeah. and how I had to go look for plan B after I did my face. Yo. By the time I got to the shop, that's the time I was supposed to be at the studio. But I did find something, although the weather is not friendly, but okay, I really wanted an outdoor real nyana. It doesn't have to be hectic, mm -hmm. you know, because just pictures and Jay is so boring. Um, so two outfits, had to find something in my closet and then the other one I had to hire. Tabanga hiring. Hiring cho me. Although my husband had suggested that he can go to the shops and look for something for me, but I had no hope that he was gonna find anything because shops in Zim very limiting. 
um and on top of that he had a tire puncture or something happened to his car i don't know at this time my data is finished my airtime is finished <sighs> so now yeah i'm hungry my face is cute but we haven't okay no but we took a couple of pictures but i mean there was like three pictures that's it and then after this we need to go to another venue that we could potentially use we're just gonna see how it is if it doesn't rain because look at the clouds sam yeah, it looks like it's about to rain one more time. Hi, yeah, let me show my people. Uh, yeah, it, that's how it looks like. But the nice bit about, oh no, but tomorrow I won't have makeup. I was about to say, if it rains, Sam, the nice bit about the hiring that dress is that you can use it. Mm -hmm. Like, you've hired it for three days. Well, I've hired it for like three days. Right. Mm -hmm. So there's still the chance of having it tomorrow, but my face won't be looking like this, though. No. That's another one. Hiya. Anyways, guys, um, let me go. Let me go. Hey guys, it's the next day after the photo shoot that gave me the stress of my life. Like, guys, yesterday was a bad day. It was a bad, bad day. I don't even know where to begin. I don't even remember where I stopped. Like, all I know is that we last spoke when I was... When I was in the car with Sam, when we were waiting for food. But then after that, just my mood went sour. The venue where I wanted to do like an outdoor reel, we found it closed. I don't know why, maybe because it was a holiday. But you'd think that it would be open because it's an art gallery and there's a cafe. I would like within the same premises, but nothing like that. And then we're like, okay, let's shoot other content that doesn't need like venue or anything. Um, so went to Cousin's house to try to change because I had my workout clothes. There was no one, nobody was opening, um, but they had traveled. But I just thought that, you know, like the workers would be home, but no. Went to the studio, they told us um, no slots till 5 p.m., right? And then ugh, we just do random things, come back at 5. They're like, the other people are not done. So it has to be 6 p.m. Guy. I was not having it because I had been driving the whole day. I felt like we are not being we're not productive at all because we literally didn't shoot anything. Um ugh, things are just not working in my favor. Like part of me was even like, maybe I'm not meant to do this shoot. Especially now. Because I'm like first it was the clothes not arriving on time. And then it was me not liking my back out outfits. And then it was the studio being fully booked. And then after that, it was, I was like, nah, I'm done. Came back home um, after five. And then I told, I told my husband that they say 6 p.m. Nah, I'm done. I don't want to do it anymore. He literally had to force me and drive me there with him. Because we actually met on the road. Um, he was going to meet me at the studio. I was like, nah, I'm going home. That time my face was so cute, like my makeup, guys. And thing is, it was imp it was hard to change the days for the shoot because um, Saturday, which is today, my makeup artist was fully booked, busy. Kind of, it's festive. It's literally two days before Christmas today. Yeah, yeah. Christmas is the day after tomorrow, so today she had a full schedule, and um, on top of that. Sam also had another shoot. So it's again, a lot was happening. A lot was happening. A lot was happening. And then, I mean, it's hot, man. 
Um, yeah, I couldn't move into today. Plus, I have to pack. We're traveling tomorrow, which is Sunday. That's like Christmas Eve. And packing as a pregnant woman is not easy. Because now, like, I'm even packing to be in Botswana till delivery. So it's like packing a lot of things you get. So, yeah. Anyways, let me continue packing. Yeah. Let me continue packing. <laughs> so far, this is how the mess is looking like. And then she's a down there. Hey, hey, what's up? Oh, hey, hey. Oh. <laughs> He's eating you greeting. What's up, guys? It's Christmas Eve, and we are about to travel to Botswana. So I was just doing a mini check-in. Mm, the time now should be like 7.30 or so. I'm just clearing up the house, cleaning up, finishing all the food in the house before we leave so that nothing rots. And let me show you my outfit of the day. My airport fit. Come on. Airport fit. Oh, no, like so. Okay. Mm. This is my fit. It is a jumpsuit and what's this? Crocs and socks. And I wore a shirt over my jumpsuit. And this is my baby, baby bump, baby. <laughs> this is my baby bump. Yeah. In this case, to be honest, I'm actually very tired. I'm so tired. But oh well. We move. Let me go finish all the food. In the house. <laughs> oh, oh, wow, uh, lighting. Hi. I just said that they love. I'm still in love with you, boy. But I want us to end up playing, and you know I'm not a stay at that. So that's it, that's it, love. Greetings, 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 all the way in Botswana. Happy Christmas Eve. I'm about to head to the village. I'm home though, like home, home, home. Like mommy and daddy's home. Not big Coco's house. <laughs> yes, my parents are back in Botswana. So I'm home. And huh, mommy bought me cake. Oh my God. They finally have the vanilla caramel cake with the fresh cream in Botswana. They stopped them during COVID and after COVID. Now they're back. And now I'm having it. I'm having it now, now, now. And I'm carrying it to the village with me. Oh, nice times. Let me show you guys. Ooh. Boots. 
so on uh, finally vanilla caramel cake Ooh, guys you don't even know you don't even know also guys by the way traveling pregnant was not too bad five months pregnant oh five seven months <laughs> seven months pregnant that wasn't too bad only the pecking bit was hectic because i was so tired in the morning i think also going up and down my staircase tidying up the house cleaning and all of that that was really hectic but all in all we survived the flight even though there was turbulence from like zambia to botswana and i'm like oh, my baby my baby is my baby okay but we good we made it um so i'm gonna stop the vlog yeah also if you're pregnant and you're trying to travel whether you're going for a baby moon you're going back to your country or whatever check with your doctor check with the airline usually you have to fly before you are eight months like nothing after seven months you can't fly so you have to be seven months and below depending on the flight that's about what 32 weeks yeah i think most of them say 32 weeks going down you can fly after that you can't so check with the flight you also do need a travel letter from your doctor just um talking about how you can still travel and how many weeks you are i had mine from my doctor but they didn't even look for it they didn't even ask me nothing but then again everybody thinks i'm like three months four months but i'm like i'm about to pop nigga yeah anyways guys i think i'm gonna close this vlog here because it was just me showing you guys the photo shoot it was also me traveling while i'm pregnant it wasn't too bad i mean I, I mean i wasn't carrying my bags or anything baby was doing everything i was just sort of kind of walking do you know but the walking bit i was walking quite slow to be honest <laughs> i was walking very slow i couldn't keep up couldn't keep up but the flight itself is not too bad it was around let me just say two hours including the time that we had to stop over in zambia but yeah my people i'll catch on in the next episode of mama vibes i love you guys and take care merry christmas in advance christmas is tomorrow i know when you see this it'll be way <laughs> over christmas um but yeah i just like recording and keeping the content and then editing all at once as a series like an episode every week like what i did with my lobola series and my white wedding series we guys should check it out if you have not done that but guys bye bye don't forget to like share and subscribe thank you for the constant support baby can't wait to see you guys online